which of the following has the highest modulus of elasticity? The options are dentine, enamel, amalgam, and composite resin. Now, talking of modulus of elasticity, it is uh, the degree of uh, relative stiffness or rigidity of a material, and the formula for that is stress by strain. That means for every amount of force or stress applied on a material, how much strain does it cause? Okay, so that is the formula for uh, elastic modulus, also known as Young's modulus. Now this is a graph for tensile stress versus the strain, and this PL or the proportional limit is the elastic modulus or modulus of elasticity, which is represented by the symbol epsilon. Now, if you see the area under the stress strain graph, you will see words like resilience and toughness. So it means that greater the modulus of elasticity, the better that material can withstand forces. That means it will not distort very easily. So the modulus of elasticity of different restorative materials and the dental materials are different. Enamel has the highest modulus of elasticity followed by amalgam, then dentine and then composite resin. Now some other things that you need to know are also the loops hardness number that is hardness of enamel is also the highest 343 that is loops hardness number followed by amalgam then dentine and then composite composite is in the range of 25 to 35 that is one tenth of enamel coefficient of thermal expansion is another thing that is asked in the exam that is the amount of expansion that occurs per degree Celsius or degree Kelvin temperature. Now coefficient of thermal expansion is highest for composite. Then amalgam. Then enamel. And then dentine. So remember these orders as well. Okay. The correct answer to highest modulus of elasticity is enamel.